how to access the file manager in a FuelTech ECU and how to save four different maps to the ECU. I'm gonna read the ECU here, click OK, and I'm just gonna pick a map. I'll pick the active map, top gas. Click OK. It reads that file. Say I wanna make a change to it. Say I just add 10% to the fuel map here just to make a change. And now I wanna write that to the ECU. So I'm gonna click save as. I'm gonna click on top gas, click okay. Now that change is made in that map and that map only. It does not change my other three maps. So it does not change Pro ET, 460, or Super Comp. It only changes the top gas map. Now I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna read ECU. It asks me if I wanna open a selected map over the currently open map. Click okay. I'm gonna open Pro ET. I'll make a dumb change here. 1.2, add 20% at 50% throttle. So I made that change there. My map name is Pro ET. This map name can be changed. I'm going to save as again. And I want to save as Pro ET. Now this will pop up. You are not writing this map to the active map position on the ECU. Do you want to make the selected map as the active map? So this means I have Pro ET. Do I want to make it the active map? The active map is the green dot. So active right now is top gas. I can click yes, and then it will make the active map, the green dot Pro ET or I can click no and it will keep the active map as top gas. So right now I'm gonna click no. It'll write that file. And it didn't change the active map. Now to get to the file manager from the main dashboard, you see this exit button at the top here? I'm gonna click that exit button and I'm gonna click File Manager. File Manager pops up. It's a little pages on the bottom right hand corner. And I'm going to click File Manager again and that will take me to those maps. I'll change that map. Click the check mark, it'll load the file. You can do this while the bike is running. You do not have to shut the bike off. You can load it into it while the bike is running. For example, if you forget to change it after you do a burnout, you look down and see that maybe the dashboard is different. If the dashboard is different from what you usually put in that into that map, then you know you have the wrong map for that particular class. So you can change it after the burnout, while the bike is running, before you stage, which is very, very nice that you don't have to recycle the power to do that. So anytime that you're writing a file, just I always make sure I do save as and I write the exact file that I want to write. When I'm reading, I just pick the file that I want to read. Any changes, again, I get this question a lot. Any changes that you make to one map does not change the other maps. So if you want to make a change to every single map, say you need to adjust 10% of fuel at 100% throttle, or you wanna change two-step RPM, you wanna change a shift RPM, 
and you want to do it to every map, you have to come in here and you have to change every map individually. You cannot change them all at once. So I hope this helps with finding the file manager, choosing a map file, and learning how to write the ECU and have four different maps already preloaded on to your ECU. If you have any questions about this, put them down in the comments below. Click the thumbs up button to like it. Subscribe, please subscribe. There's a lot of people on here that are watching that aren't subscribed. And share, please share. Thank you.